hello guys welcome back to my channel and if this is your first time of stopping by on my channel to watch this video welcome my name is peace in today's video i'm going to be talking about the vitamins that i take for my skin i'm trying i'm going to try my best to make this video as short as possible so my, we may have to talk about some other supplements in another video but in this video i'm going to be talking about some of the supplements i take for my skin why i take them and if they were worth taking the first supplement that i would really advise anyone who hasn't started any kind of supplement yet and you want to start a supplement for your skin or your general body health the first um supplement for your skin would always be water if you put yourself on a very good daily dose of water you would all you will be able to conquer dehydration and at the same time conquering most of your skin issues you look um fresh you're always glowing okay and so that's one but um let me go back to what i was talking about i was talking about supplements that are, i can recommend for your skin or the supplement that i take for my skin the first um supplement i would advise if you're choosing supplement for the first time fish oil supplements fish oil supplement is really a great supplement for hair skin and nails it is also called omega-3 fatty acid or omega-3 supplement so they can be used interchangeably so if you don't see fish oil you can see omega-3 they are containing the same thing the major component in omega-3 is our epa and our dha our epa which is our echo serpentanoic acid and our dha which is our docosahexaenoic acid these two acids are very important for our hair skin and nails and also for a healthy heart i'll be talking about fish oil in another video i'll be talking about how this work in another video it is the first um um uh, supplement i would advise anyone who is new to supplements and wants to try um fish oil is a, an absolute beautiful um what is it called supplements to try and this is a massing a massing product and you can try you can also try other products okay there are also there are also other omega-3 um or um, fish oil products in the market that you can try okay so this is my fish oil and i've been taking this cup i think i've taken more than one cup in a long time and fish oil has really helped me and this is how it looks like another um vitamin that i take for my skin is my vitamin c um supplement and this is vitamin c 1000 milligram although vitamin c can come in several several milligrams but um 1000 milligram is a very very right dose for your vitamin c so one capsule a day is perfectly okay if you have the one of 500 milligrams you can take two capsules a day vitamin c is an antioxidant that really helps to brighten the skin from the inside okay and so this is one thing i take i'm going to tell you if all these things really really was worth it when i took mine okay so let me just take you around all the supplements that i was taking okay so this is the 500 milligram of vitamin c so when i want to take this i take two capsules per day so another um a vitamin i take is my vitamin e oil vitamin e is um a very very strong antioxidant imagine taking vitamin e that's an antioxidant with vitamin c which is also an antioxidant they are great great supplements for the skin and vitamin e i usually don't take this all the time i won't lie to you i usually don't take this all the time it doesn't really come to uh come to me it doesn't really come to my mind to take it i just have it here but it's really a great um supplement i also take this another supplement i started i just started taking is um this nature's bounty hair skin and nails i just started taking this um supplement not quite long they are gummies and they're very easy to take just take two gummies per day and um i'm going to give i'm going to give this a review actually maybe after now i'm going to be giving this a review i can't say much about it because i just started taking it not quite long so um i don't know i've not noticed anything yet from the supplement but i'm going to come back to this but this is part of the supplement i take and then i also take collagen although this collagen is really tiring i won't lie to you this um collagen because it comes in powder form it comes in powder form 
it comes in powder kind of powder form and you just have to take it and add to your smoothies or your beverage to take and so it's really tiring because whenever i want to take it i would have to take a beverage or i will have to take um um, um a smoothie and it's really tiring because i can't take smoothies every day i am very lazy at that and i do not want to be taking beverages every day because i am on a diet i'm trying to watch my weight so you just can't take this on its own i don't know if it can be taken with just water but i have never tried it it's always me and smoothies or me and beverages so that's more reason why i don't like taking this particular collagen but there are collagen tablets i don't have one here probably i will drop a picture on the screen that you can just take and swallow so yes i do take collagen as well and i'm also going to be telling you if collagen was great um me taking them another supplement i took was my glutathione glutathione one supplement that a whole lot of people has been asking me to talk about i'm going to be making another video for this particular supplement glutathione if it is good or bad because so many people dread it okay so i'm going to be talking about this particular supplement in another video yes i take glutathione and this is 500 milligram i took it a powerful antioxidant and i'll tell you and then lastly but not the least i take evening prime rose um oil i have stopped taking this a whole long time ago and this is why evening prime rose oil is usually one good supplement to take when you are when you're having um hormone issues like hormonal imbalance or you're having hormonal acne or whatever but also um evening prime rose can also purge your skin it can also purge your skin it can make you break out not for everybody or do but for some people so when i took evening prime rose i actually noticed i was feeling discomfort um this particular stuff and also this probiotics um supplement if you take them you kind of feel this discomfort for the first time when you start taking them and then after some time you may get used to it and then they start helping your system they are not bad at all but i couldn't stand it actually so i stopped i stopped this evening prime rose i didn't take it much if you look look at it very well you find out that it's almost full like it's still here i didn't really take this because it really disturbed me so here are some of the supplements i took here are the ones that i am taking currently currently i'll give you updates if i change any of them or if i find any of them more helpful but these are some of the ones i'm taking right now so like i said i'm going to be giving you a review on um on each of them like my fish oil it's beautiful if you want to start yes you should start a fish oil um whatever uh, it also helps to lower cholesterol it helps the brain it helps for memory it helps a whole lot so if you see anything omega-3 fish oil whatever grab it it's very very nice okay and then for your vitamin c is vitamin c orally taken is it worth it yes it is if you're able to take vitamin c internally and you're using a vitamin c serum on your skin you're doing yourself a lot of good and you're doing your skin a lot of good as well and then for my vitamin e oil like i said it's also an um a very powerful antioxidant and yes it helps the skin but not compulsorily you can do away with it but if you want to yes you can try vitamin e oils and for this i said i was going to give you a review because i just started not too long so i can't tell you this or that but so many people have really said this is good but i'm going to come back and tell you if it's good or not and for my collagen i don't know what to say i don't know what to say because i've not seen anything that collagen has done i won't lie to you i won't lie i won't lie probably probably i'll be making another video i don't know but collagen i've tried i think this is the third cup or fourth cup i've taken for collagen and i've also taken the caplets as well before now and i cannot say a thing that collagen has done for me normally it's supposed to help build collagen stronger hair stronger nails renew cells and all that but I never see anything evening prime rose i already told you i already told you why uh, i stopped taking it so i can't say much about it the only thing i'll tell you is that i can break it can make you break out for some skin meanwhile after breaking out which is the purging of the skin it will also help you to repair your skin um balance your hormone especially for those who have hormonal acne evening prime rose is a, a nice choice but i don't know i can't say for everybody 
all right so i i stopped taking um evening primers and then my glutathione it actually assisted my vitamin c and my vitamin e to help me fight free radicals and help me to um you know reduce sun damage actually but for skin lightening uh, 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 mm -mm. i'll make another video on this to tell you what and how i took it and how you can misuse it the side effect everything you need to know about um glutathione i'm going to make a quick video and don't worry it's going to be as fast as possible so here are some of the supplements that i took um that i am taking currently um i also take um green teas for now and there are some diy teas i also make and uh, you know mix i'm probably going to be sharing the tips um with you or sharing a recipe of some of my teas with you and then also i take some other um supplements for my weight loss self-made i'll tell you because i'm going to also share a video of my weight loss journey how i turn from this to this don't shout i'm going to share that video i have a lot of questions about supplements especially for those of you since i don't believe in supplements and some of them would be like you're a pharmacist please tell us if it's good to take supplements i take supplements so what are you saying supplements are very nice like now let me tell you the reason why you have to take supplements some of these things are essentially needed in our body for our, our general well-being for our immune system for our skin for our body for our, um, our hearts for um, the right functioning of our organs but we do not have them in our meals every day we do not have them in our meals like we eat every day but the new these nutrients are not found um in uh, the, in the proper amount in our foods like for example fish oil that is extracted from the fish itself most of the time we eat we can eat our three square meal without having fish in the diet and some of us who would have fish in diets the fish may be too small to provide us with the um necessary dosage of the fish oil that we need daily to help our total um whatever so by the time we take this supplement they help to supplement those things that we mix out in our food like in our vitamin c sometimes we forget to take fruits most of us and some of the times that we take food we can take fruits today and for and not take again till another week so we are not having this um, um vitamins enough to cater for our health needs so that is why we we have supplements to help us supplement those nutrients in our daily meal so when we take these supplements daily we are helping to supplement those nutrients that we miss out in our daily food which our body needs so supplement is of no way bad and those of you who are also asking if supplements have side effects there is nothing in this life that does not have side effects but supplements has very minimal side effect very minimal side effect and most of the side effects are not more than nausea um, um git retention and that's why they advise you to take your supplement with a lot of food to avoid git retention and also maybe you have um um let me say you can't have a serious side effect with taking supplement that's the truth except for when you misuse your supplement like taking an overdose or taking your supplements with other medications basically supplements are very good for your skin supplements are very good for your skin especially when in fact there is no time that you don't need supplements children need supplements um adults need supplements the aged especially need supplements and that is why you find out that so people can have a very great skin without using any skincare products because they mind what they take and they're able to supplement the, the nutrients that their body needs and they are missing out on your food by taking good supplements so here are the, some of the supplements that you can take for your skin and if there are more i'll let you know and if you have any questions about supplements that you want to ask please ask me in the comment section i'm going to be answering them in another video many of you are asking me what's your skincare routine what's your skincare routine if i tell you my skincare routine and you try it and it doesn't work for you you might think i am lying but no, I'm not lying. There are so many other things that I'm doing for my skin. Make supplements as part of your skincare routine. And it does not just help just your skin. It also helps your vital organs. It also helps your body. Alright, so if you want to know more about glutathione, stay tuned in my next video. I'm going to be talking about glutathione in another video so if this video was helpful to you please give me a thumb up and also subscribe to this channel for more amazing tips recipes and diys on skincare and your general health so thank you thank you so much for watching this video i hope it was helpful to you 
please i want to see you in my next video don't run away so that's why i asked you to please subscribe it's totally free thank you for watching let's see in the next video all right bye <laughs> take care